Hello, everyone. Uh, this week, we are going to focus on amazing artists who also have served in the military um, in honor of Memorial Day weekend. And just, you know, it's important to know that artists come from all different backgrounds and have all different life experiences. Our first artist of the week is the wonderful Bob Ross. You may know him for his famous TV series, The Joy of Painting, but he also did serve for 20 years uh, in the Air Force. So we're going to talk about that. His quote that I'm sharing is, look around, look at what we have. Beauty is everywhere. You only have to see it. Uh, he's also, of course, known for his quotes about happy little mistakes and his beautiful landscape paintings. So let's look at his career and life because there's so much more to Bob Ross than most people know. So Bob Ross enlisted in the United States Air Force at 18 years old and served as a medical records technician. He eventually rose to the rank of Master Sergeant and served as the first Sergeant of the U.S. Air Force Clinic in Alaska. Uh, this is also where he saw snow and mountains and a lot of this became a big theme in his artwork. He was inspired by the nature around him. At this time he developed art as a hobby, as a quick painting technique. He created art for sale during his work breaks. However, um, at the end of his military career, uh, Ross felt that he never wanted to shout or raise his voice again. He said, uh, you know, this is it for me. And because he had to be a certain way in this role, he was the opposite as a painter. And that's why he's known for his uh, iconically soothing, uh, mellow voice and his even temper. So let's look at what led him further into his career. So in the top left corner, you're going to see William Alexander. He was a former German prisoner of war during World War II who moved to America after the war to take up painting. Well, as soon as Bob Ross met this artist, he was instantly inspired. And that is what led him to start his own public broadcasting station uh, show, The Joy of Painting. He became known for his wet on wet painting techniques where he would layer oil paints very quickly uh, to, before drying. Um, and he also used very reasonably priced materials. He wanted art to be accessible for everyone. Uh, another financial kind of fun fact about Bob Ross is that he wanted to save money on haircuts and got a perm and that's where and how he developed this iconic hairstyle. It was uh, simply for that reason. His series, he didn't get paid for his show, but of course his products that sold after were where he made his money. Um, but the show itself, he did completely free. There were over 400 episodes taped from 1983 to 1994. And um, you know, you're gonna know about him through pop culture now. He is kind of an iconic person um, and his style, but he truly loved landscapes. He loved painting and he, did bring a lot of joy through painting in people's lives to their through their TV screens and now through YouTube and other ways. So uh, today we honor Bob Ross as an artist, but also for his time uh, served. And we really appreciate you, Mr. Ross. 